Well, do you remember that movie? I think it was Cary Grant. It's in some boat. I think it was Cary Grant. Maybe it was Rock Hudson. I don't know. But right out there is that island that he was clinging to before the Coast Guard got. What I heard about this road was that there were gravel this big and deep. Well, there is. Before the meteor hit, it had created so much pressure in the atmosphere between the Earth and itself that it exploded. And when it exploded, it blew all these valleys, these finger arm valleys. Of course, the Ice Age has come and gone, and it was prior to that. So it's been a long time. But it's a pretty neat place to be standing to know that something came out of the sky and impacted right here. I better get out of here. One of the first things I saw after I got off the ferry here in Nova Scotia this morning was a sign that says Bras d'Or. I'm thinking, whoa, Bras of Gold. My gosh, what do these people do up here? My gal Merritt made it to Woodstock. She was one of the first there and one of the last to leave. Now this might not be the field, but it looks pretty good and you can just let your imagination run wild. Quiet. You might even hear the spirits of those early Woodstockers. Floyd has an event which has been going on every Friday night for almost 30 years, which is called the Friday Night Jamboree. We're in the heart of the Blue Ridge Mountains, and every Friday night, a, a, a bunch of musicians get together and start playing old-time Appalachian music. The town of Mayberry, made famous in the Andy Griffith Show, is actually located in Mount Airy, North Carolina. And that's just a couple hours away. I think I'm going to have to stop by, maybe say hi to Andy and Barney. When I got to Mayberry, I headed for Wally's service station. I was hoping to buy some gas. This isn't a typical courthouse of the Old South. This is great. Riding the back roads of Southern Georgia brought to mind the rock and blues style of the Southern rock bands. And that played in my head all day long. Now look here, baby. Yeah, I'm talking to you. I ain't got no time for messing with a fool. Cause you have me have a three foot dog, so I'm gonna be starting to eat a burger too. That's that's what I wanted for is a couple of hamburgers. But he's always wanting some money. Me too. Christmas and New Year's Eve. That's how good it feels.